now, uh, scriptures tell us the following. A lot of you know these scriptures. Moses 6, verse 62 and 63, all things bear record of Christ. Uh, 2 Nephi 11, verse 4, all things typify Christ. They're types of Christ. All things, Jacob 4, 5, point to to Christ. And so one of the things that I used to tell the members of my ward when I was a bishop, and one thing that I tell my BYU students is when you go to the temple, if you're struggling with the symbolism there and you're not understanding it, first of all, remember this message, okay? Most of the symbol, not all, but most of the symbolism of the temple has to do something with one of two things. Number one, the atonement of Jesus Christ, or two, the outcomes of his atonement, even eternal life, okay? And so we're going to be talking about those two things tonight, symbolism of the temple as it relates to his atonement and the outcomes of the atonement, eternal life.